Have you ever made soap? Not at all. She's never made soap before ever. She's getting like the high five best star ever right here at the Cornerstone Market because we're doing business making soap making classes. Yay. And she has been, we've already had her sit down in front of the computer screen and discussed our oils and super fats and how a bar, the, basically the manufacturing of a soap bar and what's in there and why. And now she has got her five crock pots over there and she's filled them herself. Yay! And we have her lye sitting here and it's all cooling from being in the refrigerator, but we're gonna be mixing lye later on today. She can't get out of mixing lye. She's gotta learn how to play with lye and play with lye, lye safely, but we wanted to get a kickstart on the day, so we made Bridget do it yesterday. <laughs> And we're sipping on our tea but the reason that we were doing this video is because one of the things that you have to bring with you is you've got to bring your soap molds and your soap baskets and what kind of soap molds do we use silicone we use the clear silicone or white silicone molds and where do we get them i forgot the name of it essential depot that's it that's it she's not watched enough of my videos <laughs> i will though i will <laughs> So we already plopped it out of the box, but we have our invoice. And uh, one of the things when you're buying their, the soap molds is don't cut down like this. I always get worried somebody will accidentally cut the mold. I tell people, cut the sides in first, like this, and so that you've got that. Then you can put your finger under there and you can go down so you know that you're not accidentally cutting your mold because these molds will last you forever at her funeral <laughs> slash afterwards estate sale people will be fighting over these molds <laughs> they're going to be passed down <laughs> <laughs> that's how long they last <laughs> they last forever now the only thing you can do is you could melt them Oh. You know, you could do that hot process, hot process, oven process, and you could accidentally put them in there too hot. And just like any of your baking molds, uh, these are made out of the same thing that you'll see in Walmart or Target where they've got silicone baking molds. Like candy molds. Yeah, 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 but feel how thick those are. Those are thick. So you're going to have to work a lot harder to make these things melt, uh, melt than you are anything that you get uh, from Walmart. Um, now, these little boxes are really handy for storing things in and transporting things. You can put fragrances in there by category on a shelf and different things. Would you like to keep your boxes? Absolutely. All right. Unless you need them. Mm -mm. Okay. They're Absolutely. all yours. But I keep these, this style, this little box because I find it so down, hang, uh, downright handy. So I'm going to put it back in your box um, and everything. So now once you get one of the molds out, you can open up the plastic and then what's the next thing you're supposed to do you know you have to wash them you gotta wash them all right and and that be be because there could be a residue of some type of powder or something they used in shipping i mean in the process of making them in their molds you know because this was molded in a mold so you just a mold them. is made in a mold right and, and and so it could have some kind of residue on it that they use for whatnot, so it's just safe, safer to wash them. So I will, we will do that, but for the purposes of this video, we're gonna go ahead and show you, this is the Essential Depot basket. And this is a, well, I call it a stabilizing basket. I don't know if they call it a stabilizing basket, but I call it a stabilizing basket. And when you're putting these things in, um, you put them in there, and you get them lined up and you just, I just punch them down. And right here, see how that sort of hung on that last rack? And if you don't recognize it happened, your soap will be lopsided. So always make sure that, and sometimes I have to sit and just give it a little tap there. But you wanna make sure that it's fully on the bottom. And here is one. These are so easy to get your soap out of. See, so you they come out real easy. Um, but one of the things that is so awesome about these baskets is because it is because whenever you are using them, 
We, oftentimes we're in our kitchen when we're making soap. Uh, as you progress in your business, you may find that you can take an extra bedroom or a basement or a garage and develop it into your soap kitchen or even buy an extra building and put it inside the house, which is what I ended up doing eventually. Uh, but what's so wonderful about these when it comes to counter space is they stack. And I stack them as high as four high. If you have several six high, then you could do them six high, but I stack them as high as four high without issue by themselves right on the counter. So that's four whole crock pots full of soap in one little bitty tiny place on your countertop. So that really eliminates a space problem. The only time you have an issue with that is if you've made an exceptionally tall bar of soap. If you've made a tall bar of soap that protrudes above the mold, you can't stack them. All right. So uh, we will continue opening these up. When you're working with these, what's also, now one of the reasons that, that we use these is it keeps the sides stabilized mm -hmm. so our soap comes out perfectly square and we don't end up with some bulging in the center, which is common with any kind of mold that you buy. And the thinner the mold is, the more the bulging would occur and the more you would need stabilizing boxes. Uh, but another reason that we use it is because we have handles that we can tote it and like when, especially cold processed soap if you touch that mold you're going to end up with a crack oh. uh, because that soap is so tender mm -hmm. so you can sit and take it and you can move it without problem of damaging your cold process design or bar you also have this part so you can lift it up and move it and if you do end up working with the oven method You've got something you can grab with your pot holders to get it in and out of the oven. So that's another reason that they are, that's one of the reasons they're made out of metal, is so that you can put them in the oven. All right, so, and now that is, I guess that's just all about that. Okay, that sounds good. Yeah, I like the ones that, that are silicone white. These have no pigment in them, so they didn't add any color to them. So um, sometimes with a dark mold, you on your first couple of times that you use it until you get it broke in, you might say, sometimes with a solid white soap, the color of the mold will transfer into the um, soap. But Essential Depot offers this natural method so that there's nothing there that can ever transfer into your soap. So that's why we like to go with the white ones, which, which really these are clear. This is just the color of the silicone with nothing added to it. It's just 100% silicone. All right, so, and then you also got your FYI uh, free sample. Yes, I love it. All right, and now did you become, I'm assuming you became an FYI member. I did. Uh, and you get all kinds of bargains and discounts. And do you know how to log into your FYI membership and see all the different codes? I do. So make sure that you go on to the Essential Depot website and become an FYI member. And when you, then you log into the account, but then you've got to log into the FYI page to, which I think has a different, mine has a different password than my regular account login. Mm -hmm. And you got to go in there and sometimes they have 50% off on stuff coupons. Yes, I got a coupon on this as well. Yeah, how much of a discount did you get on this? Uh, I want to say 30%. 30% off because she's going to pay how much a month? Uh, is it $5 a month? $5 a month and you can get all those specials. But if you're not going into your FYI account and randomly going in there and checking to see what coupons are good, then you'll miss out on your savings. And then if you click, uh, if you add this free sample to cart, It'll then come up and say, are you an FYI member? And you click yes, and then it'll go into your shopping cart. You also get this free sample. And this is organic extra virgin olive oil. That's mm. awesome. And this is a sample of, oh, the red wine fragrance. Ooh. I like it. So you can make some wine, so. That's good. And let's see, what's this one? What's this one? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, turmeric root. Timber root is an anti-inflammatory that's really great for acne soaps. Oh, wow. So that would make a good acne soap addition. And then you have glycerin. I use one tablespoon of glycerin 
per per batch a small crock pot or four four quart crock pot of soap and so in here is two ounces so you've got four batches of soap paid for right there Yay. you want to for four batches of soap you don't even have to buy glycerin and and you got all of this it's free and it was free and she just paid five dollars a month so I'm telling you, become FYI members. It pays at Essential Depot. All right, so uh, let's see. Can I think of anything else I got to tell you about these molds? Well, I'll tell you one thing. If you're gonna be in one of my classes, you gotta buy five of them and baskets. Because what happens, we put the soap in here and then tomorrow, and then you'll take those to your hotel or drive home, whichever the case be with them all nice and safe and stabilized in the mold. And tomorrow, you'll be able to dump them out and cut them. And cut them. Yay! Woohoo! I'm excited. All right. Okay. You want to say bye to YouTube? Bye, YouTube. Bye, everybody. Thank you so much for watching our little video. And if you'd like to become a student here at, uh, at the Cornerstone Market with me from Essential Soap, Feel free to get a hold of me uh, on our Facebook uh, Facebook page, uh, Essential Soap or Cornerstone Market or Kimberly Phillips Matnet page. And those are all business pages, but you just search for them like we're people. And she's awesome, guys. She's <laughs> awesome. <laughs>